welcome back to the channel, YouTube. As you guys can tell from the title, we'll be taking our court to a track cross event. And as you guys just watched me, I torqued down the wheels. Um, you know, with any track event, high speed event, you want to make sure your wheels are torqued, safety precautions, and everything. So, without further ado, let's get this video started. <laughs> four wheels tightened and here's what we're just packing a jack some lawn chairs tire pump right there in a toolbox with my impact uh, half inch and three eighths so yeah we'll see you guys tomorrow at the track we've made it to summit point we've got our car inspected we're ready to go with our wristband so yeah i'll put on the gopro once we get started here we go, getting ready for our warm-up lap. All right, whenever you're ready. So wet out there, holy shit. God damn. It did not like that one bit. Whew. And that was a warm up too, holy shit. All right, you're good. good felt good all right we'll check what our times are once we get back to paddock our best time today is 74 seconds 74.66 so far still second in class we'll see once we get back once that fiora runs how they do but honestly probably will beat me so you know i'm pretty happy with second in class given how heavy this car is not bad not bad all right getting ready for the second circuit of the day earlier we did jefferson to now we're about to start on maine so catch you guys out there all righty warm-up lap time let's see how we do
right, we can go faster on that straight. Okay. Warm up lap. Beginning, we can take it a bit faster. Middle section, I felt pretty good. Last corner there, we can definitely take faster. So we're gonna do that. Alrighty, second timed lap. Let's see how this goes. We did a 68 and some change. I wanna see if I can get a 66. Currently, who's in front of me is a Corvette Z06, which you know what, on this track, plenty of straights. Don't expect to catch up on him. I just want to keep second in novice class, hopefully. So let's see if we can do that. Five seconds. but I felt much better on that one. So I'm hoping my time is good. We are gonna check once we get back to paddock. Let's check the times. 66.5. All right, not bad, we shaved off two seconds. Let's go. All right, it's getting towards midday. So, so far in the video we've done at this track, um, Jefferson and Shenandoah, Maine. Next one we're gonna do is just Shenandoah. So far I'm placing second in both tracks in novice class, so good for us, you know? Not too bad I'd say for a front wheel drive family car. So I'll catch you guys in the third track. All right, getting ready for our warm-up lap. Five, four, three, two. Yep. This one, got it. Okay. Oh, this one's a bit. Uh -huh. I don't like this one. This one may be a little too technical for me. I got myself a little bit lost there, I'm not gonna lie. Um, damn. Yeah, this one's a little confusing for me. Um, shit. <laughs> I 
going to study the map a little bit more. Thankfully, that one was only a warm-up lap. Alrighty. Final timed lap. Don't be a bitch. I tell myself, don't be a bitch. Don't lift. We'll be scared of that damn blind corner. Put it in the weeds. Last car of the last run. You can do that. We can all leave while the fucking tow truck is <laughs> truck. Five seconds. Last run. Two one at the line. And go. Still lifted a bit early. But you know what? Felt pretty good. I think I shaved off one second. I'm just gonna say 79. I'm gonna call 79. I hope that's what I got. Man, that is a fun circuit. Alrighty, today was a fun day. I'm gonna head back, go to paddock, and go clean up, and I think we'll call it a day. Got to mention, my last time just now was a 77.3. So, we did three seconds better, not bad. All right, closing out the video today on our track event. I'm really happy with how we did today. Morning was wet, but you know what? Tires worked out in our favor. Um, speaking of tires, the tires I ran today were 255 4018s. Continental DWS 06 Pluses inflated at 35 PSI. They did terrific in the wet track this morning and they held up perfectly fine um, throughout the day. But yeah, Accord handles really well. And if you're interested in taking it to the track, I would recommend you know starting off in autocross if you've never been, if you've never done a race event before, do autocross. Then if you have it available near you, do a track cross or HPDE, um, but yeah. Mods that are done to the car handling wise are just some Swift Spec R lowering springs and a Progress 22 millimeter rear sway bar. Uh, tires are 18 by eight and a half. Um, and I have the Brembo brakes and dock for fluid and EBC red stuff pads all around. Held up great. Um, I'll probably do an HPDE event uh, come March, and at that point I'll probably swap out my fluids for some uh, Moltul 660 and probably some yellow stuff pads just to help with the longevity of doing multiple laps instead of doing like a small one. But yeah, um, if you guys enjoyed that track video, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.